Sam drinks beer. This is a beer review. So the beer today comes from Warsaw in Poland. It is a can from Funky Fluid. It's a can of their Gelata Pesh Melba, a peach and raspberry sour. I don't think this is a collab, but there is a French flag next to the Funky Fluid logo. I've looked at Untapped, it doesn't say it's a collab. So, and unfortunately the can's all in Polish, so. Oh, hang on, no, it's to say, inspired by dessert, which delighted us in France, there is an English translation, beg your pardon. So, yeah. It's, yeah, obviously a um, bit of a French twist on a Italian style ice cream, I guess, because gelato is obviously Italian. And by Polish brewery, so all good fun. So let's crack it open. I've had one of these gelato beers once before a while ago. Now it was, I think it was a, it was a was it a lime and lime? I think there was lime in it. A lime and mango one possibly. That was nice. I remember it being very lively. So let's see if this is. No, this isn't lively at all. <laughs> that one was, but maybe that one got shaken up. This one is quite. Yeah, it's quite calm, really. I think I might even get it all in the glass in one go, which would be unheard of for me. Or I won't, because it's a 500 mil can. I didn't take that into account. So, oh, it smells lovely. I smell the raspberries. I'm not getting a, a lot of um, peach on the nose, really. It's quite sweet, tart raspberries. Nah, yeah, I'm searching for the peach. It's not on the nose, is there? Is there lactose in this? Yes, there is, so hopefully I'll have a nice creamy mouthfeel when we dive in. Yeah, it just smells lots and lots of tart raspberries really on the nose. And sort of sweetness. Let's dive in. Hmm. That is tasty. Lovely mouthfeel. Very creamy. Get a little bit of peach on that one to taste. Uh, the raspberry is definitely the more dominant fruit, but you'd expect it to be because raspberry does bring more sort of tart and sour characters than a than peach does, but it sort of had sort of a softer sort of layer to it. It's quite sour and tart, but it's sort of like a sweet peach in there. Very tangy. Oh, it's lovely. Sort of getting maybe not ice, not maybe not gelato vibes, but sort of like sorbet vibes from this for sure. And it's certainly um, better than any of the um, Buxton Omnipolo ice cream beers they try they try doing. You know, this one feels like it's got a bit more purpose for them. This actually has you know, it's mark. This is actually a sour. You know, actually. You know, it's got something going on. It's got sourness and tartness. It's not just like someone's chucked a load of fruit and lactose in a uh, pale ale, which is what they were like. You know, and I remember really enjoying the other gelato beer I had. I mean, it was about a year ago now. Pardon me. Long before my YouTube days. Oh, it's really creamy. Yeah, the flavours really complement each other really well. Because it's not really something I've, I'd ever think about, really. Um, I guess um, peach and... <sighs> peach and raspberry.
as a combination. Coats the mouth as well, it's got a body. No, this is lovely. So let's get it rated up. Um, yeah, it's got, it tastes lovely. It's got a good smell to it. Even if the peach doesn't come out in the smell, it just, it sort of, it, it lads, and it, the raspberry's the dominant flavour, but the peach sort of has a nice sort of sweetness, sweet smoothness in the background for the sort of tartness and the sourness from the raspberries. To rate this up, uh, great body, lovely, lovely and creamy. Especially that it's um, it's not a stupid ABV, five point four percent. Really tangy. It's just when I drink again, I'll definitely look for more of the gelato series. I'm gonna give this a um, I'm gonna give this a four point. Five, so yeah, a very good rating. Really enjoying this. Um, I don't think it was stupidly expensive either. Like I think it was less than a fiver. So yeah, well worth it. So yeah, what I definitely recommend. So yeah, thank you for watching. Um, this has been some drinks beer. Um, please drop us your thoughts in the comments. Likes will be much appreciated. Subscriptions will be much appreciated. Um, yeah, thank you for those who, you know, comment on my videos. And, you know, I always, I'll try and reply to most of you. Um, yeah, I'd, follow me on Instagram, Sandrix Beer YT. I've been on tap, Sandrix Beer 93. And hopefully I'll catch you on the next one. Cheers.